Annie is the 2014 version of the popular play Annie, which stars Annie, played by Quavonchene Wallace, if that's how you pronounce her name, who is a foster kid who was abandoned by her parents at an early age, and she lives in this foster home run by Cameron Diaz, and one day she's running the streets, almost gets ran over, and Will Stack saves her, who is played by Jimmy Fox. He's running for mayor, he's becoming popular, has her move in, he's raising in the lead for mayor, and they develop this friendship, and it's all happy. I was looking forward to this because I'm a big fan of musicals from Mamma Mia to Rock of Ages to Sing in the Rain, anything that's filled with music, I am in. And I also was a little bit worried because at some scenes it does look cheesy, but I gotta say Annie is surprisingly a lot of fun. This isn't an Oscar worthy film, doesn't have that great of acting, but it is filled throughout with beautiful, fun upbeat music that keeps you going throughout and you're just interested in the music and what I like about the music is that it doesn't all focus on Annie uh, played by Covance Wallace it has everybody singing you have Cameron Diaz singing you have Jamie Foxx singing you have Rose Byrne singing you have all the young girls in the foster home singing so everybody is singing songs and it all fits perfectly to the scene that is going on or the moral of the story or the big picture, which I really liked and I liked hearing everybody singing and offering um, their part to the scene. And it felt like Glee a little bit where, um, you know, people will start doing things like start brooming and then you hear a little beats and then the music starts going and everybody knows the words. So that kind of felt like Glee. Uh, I really liked Glee when I first watched it, but not anymore. But here it was okay. It was a lot of fun. Um, some scenes in the movie, the dialogue really felt like a Broadway show. It was all textbooked and strict, and it just felt like they were talking to the audience, which I was kind of not in, but it was only like one or two scenes that did that, and I noticed it a lot. Also at the end, technology became a big role in the end scene as like, uh, Annie was on Instagram and Twitter and Vine and Facebook and YouTube, all that stuff, and it all helped at the end, which I think that the technology was heavy handed um, towards the end. But I gotta say, Annie, I just, I had a really fun time with it. I think that it's because it was just filled entirely with music. Every scene there was a new song, and they were just filling this thing in with music. And I enjoyed all of the songs. There was not one song that I did not care for. All of them were had like this modernized, upbeat uh, tone to it, which I haven't seen any other versions of Annie, not even the movies or the plays. But I know of Annie because that's how because because that's how popular she is. But I loved all the music. They were all fun, and I was smiling. And even some of the slower songs, they were really beautiful. And I really liked the. Um, the relationship between Jamie Foxx and Quavonchene Wallace, Will Stack, and Annie. He is the kind of guy that just wants to be by himself and doesn't really know what family is to him. He's a hardworking man and she brings, she comes into the house and kind of opens up uh, him and he's becoming more open to her and relationships and just having fun. You can see that change in him and he's got great character development from this one guy who's just hardworking, strict to the guy at the end who's just more open and friendly and cares about her and what is she is doing. So I really like that and everybody in the film had like this natural smile on their face uh, when they were singing and dancing, even acting. So it made it seem more believable and you can tell that everybody just had a really great time filming this movie and it shows and I really appreciate that because I don't want to see dull faces, uh, textbook faces. I want to see you know everybody lively and having a lot of fun while they're singing, and everybody did, which I really appreciate about that. So I'm gonna go ahead and give Annie an A minus. I was up on my seat, having a lot of fun with this, and just kind of trying to sing along with the words, humming it and stuff. So I just had a lot of fun with Annie. So this is Justin watches movies on his review for the 2014 version of the popular play Annie, which stars Quavonchene Wallace. Um, Jamie Foxx and Rose Byrne and Cameron Diaz. Hope you had a great Thanksgiving break and I'll see y'all later. Bye.